All right, so it's lunchtime right now, and I'm got an egg, and I'm gonna put a little water and whisk this because I'm making a a steak with the seasoning, you know, country fried steak that I usually have. And after I'm done whisking this for a couple seconds, then I'm gonna put some salt and then like pepper. And these are some of the breadcrumbs I'm using for extra, you know, seasoning taste. Okay, so I keep whisking this. Also, I got my blender back, so now in the morning on the days I work out, I can make my uh, protein smoothie. So, at least that's done, and I can't believe how recovered I felt after drinking that and then working out today. And I got a log press bar coming this week, and I can't wait to start working on one of that and not just a standard bar, well, barbell. Okay, a little bit of this. Anyway, um, I'm gonna put all that onto one of the plates so I can kind of batter the steak and then I'll let you guys know when I'm uh, done doing that and I'll let you guys know what my meal's gonna be in a little bit so I'll see you after I'm done having lunch. Anyway, after I was done with the Dipping it in the yolk on both sides, I let it drip some of that off for a minute onto that other plate, and then I got most of the breadcrumbs that I would have needed for this part. And now I'm just gonna let that pan heat up real quick before I can fry my steak up, and then I'll be able to have my lunch. So it all worked out good, and I think you can use either like milk or like some water when you whisk up the yolk if you're trying to get it so you can batter it and then with get a breading or whatever for steak, chicken, or any kind of meat really. But anyway, um, I'm just going to have this for my lunch and then probably fry an egg, a free range one that I got. And then in a little bit, I'll show you the meat that I'm making up and then some noodles to go with that. Okay.